Let's go inside and see what it's all about. It's got two doors. One door I put a ladder to go to be able to go up to the roof rack. So I made the interiors myself from plywood. This is the bed area, also storage area. As you can see here, you lift both of the both sides have uh, some hinges on this side and you can open them separately. It's got a uh, lights. I've got two closets, one on each side for storage. It's got a table with a stove and on the other side I have a sink. There's my water jug. I'll show you that in just a second. This is one of the closets here. I've got clothing, some random stuff, some baby wipes, some clothes, some more clothing here. Uh, let's, let's go in. So on this side here I have my coffee utensils, the stove, this is the sink. There's a grey water tank below. And this is my water jug. So I can wash my hands, brush my teeth, you know, whatever it's needed. Got my soap, my dish washing soap, my hand soap, toothpaste, some paper towels. Over here there's another storage area, another closet. Got a mirror. Some uh, drawers. Uh, down here, there's another another part of the closet. I store some random stuff over there. I have this box, and I made this top lid of wood. Very convenient for when I'm sleeping. I can put my water, my glasses, my flashlight, whatever. It's pretty roomy. As you can see, really comfortable, looks pretty nice, beautiful scenery I have right here, really comfortable, I like it, and it's comfortable also because it's insulated of course, so I got no problems with uh, being too warm or too cold. Let's see what else. Over here I have a box. Uh, also like a drawer. Have my knives, my machetes, my parang. Right here. Over here I have a basket that I can use for you know my dirty laundry or you know, some other random stuff here, some cooking gear. There's some pretty decent space down below. Pretty decent space. I made everything myself here on the inside of my camper. So as you can see there are many imperfections everywhere but it does a, it does the job really nicely. So I can't complain. So this is my truck camper, the truck is a 2010 Nissan NP300 diesel 4x4, four wheel drive and I had custom made this camper shell and the rack on top from a local camper shell builder and uh, it's insulated and it's worked perfectly for me and what, what I need. So this is what the inside of my camper looks like. I've got my kitchen area. I'm brewing up some coffee right now. Let's see if my coffee's ready. It 
it's not bo it's not boiling yet. My coffee's not boiling yet. Almost ready. Yeah, it's all good. Okay, so my my coffee's ready now. It's nothing like morning coffee. Look at that. Mm -mm. Good morning. Oh yeah. So I hope you liked the video guys. I encourage you to take advantage of your pickup and make yourself a camper. It's really convenient. There are tons of designs. I hope you like this design that I made. Maybe you can use some ideas. And uh, that's it. Thanks for so much for watch watching. I'm gonna relax and enjoy. This is P. Suarez coming at you with another video.